Falling stars brought us the here. I find it really odd when some players say that Novaria is a pretty lackluster mage. I mean, I could see why, because when you have a not very good Novaria in your team, it feels like your team is missing a hero. And probably those players who feel that way is because they had encountered the situation a lot, so they had this kind of bias against her. But those who have watched my videos a lot already know that she's one of the best mages in the current meta. But to be honest, I mainly like to play her because it's really satisfying to snipe others. Smiley face. I'll return the favor to the stars. By the will of the stars. My home has long gone with those stars. I bet Lolita I started to have a different opinion about Novaria already. Shine for me. Ally has been slain. A kind of blueness, boundlessness, devoured me. And then Launch, it became me. Shine for me. Meet your end. Novaria can rotate so fast that it's so easy to catch the opponents off guard. Stargazing is not lonely in Erudicio. So close. The stars see all, but they never care. Oh, I have ready. my destiny on my fingertips. Celestial revelation. Shine bright and kill. Picking Layla in Mythic Rank and above is like playing the game in extreme mode. There are some players who enjoy that kind of suffering so I can see why there are still many who enjoy playing her. That's why I sometimes play her as well. XT. Brilliant. Behold the stars. Stellar confinement. Remember that whenever you use her second skill, it's better to walk through the walls so you can move faster and gain more charges on her second skill. Always prioritize the main damage dealers first. Come to me. Our turret has been 
If Karina managed to catch me out of position, she can probably one-shot me, so I gotta pay extra attention to her positioning at all time. This is what I was afraid of. Just one moment of carelessness and poof, you're dead. Ouch. That's why I also don't really enjoy going against a good Novaria either. She is one of the most annoying mages to deal with. Maybe we got a bit too comfortable. They had completely turned the table. Not really sure how that was the marksman fault. Heroes with a dash skill are your sitting dogs for Novaria. Oh, maybe that's what he meant by marksman map. Shine for me. Shut down. The 
If only the passive or lightning truncheon was up, that definitely would have been a kill. Rain of stars. The team was slowly losing their patience with our marksman. I saw their Karina around the bot lane, so I was worried that she would try to flank us and kill our backlines first. We had a pretty smooth early game, but like most of you already know, in solo rank, anything can happen in the late game. If the DPS on your team decide to turn off their brain and just play like AI, then it becomes very challenging to end the game. Victory! Anyway, I wonder if this Lolita would be okay having a Novari as a teammate after this match. <laughs> 